Toma 2. Listen, I love Toma, but right now, it's looking like the main character accelerator. Well, we learned from the other, you know, Index and like Toru videos that there isn't really a main character in these shows. The main character is Academy City and everything kind of happening in it. And there's a lot of different, you know, cast, the roster that's involved in it. Right now, Accelerator is the focus. And Accelerator has his own Index. Misaka Misaka, 20,001, right? Last Order, the defect product. Right now, she got out of the incubation period too early. She seems to be very sick. Technically, it's due to a virus. Due to that owl guy who was like kind of working on it, the dude that drove off in like the yellow like um, sports car. Accelerator has two choices, destroy or protect. Do we go after the scientist guy and try to get some information or do we bring back Misaka Misaka back to the incubator? He chose the second option, but I highly doubt that she's still in the restaurant Julian's that we left off. Let's begin today's reaction. They love replaying that scene. <laughs> Thank you, Toma, for letting us know. Fucking Toma, you know, narrator recap, breaking the fourth wall. Accelerator should be the one doing this recap, bro. Virus code, final signal. Uh-oh. Toma? They fought in the past? Wait, that's not Toma. That's not Toma. It's a random kid. That's not Toma. That's not Toma. It's, it's a random dude just punching with his right arm. He's always had that power, huh? Mm. He only goes by Accelerator. What's his name, though? Damn. What is it, bro? What the fuck is happening? Is this Academy City? Is this like a government test? Or is it somewhere else where people are scared of who Accelerator is and the powers that he has and people are like, oh my god, we need to stop him. Hey, he said that again. This is bullshit. That's his signature line. If Thomas is just my luck. Dude, this is literally Thomas saving index arc. At midnight, memory will disappear. This is our index. Midnight, bad shit will happen. You better save her. All the other sisters get infected too. You trusted a random old man in a trench coat to take a fucking lolly? Have you not? That's a clearly a predator. What are you doing? And of course, it was fucking stupid to leave her here. Like, we just... If we just left her here, of course she's gonna be gone. He probably is a scientist. Maybe someone else. That guy. Did he just literally come back? Like, that's hilarious to think about. That he left when we arrived here because he was probably trailing us or something. But then he left. And we went. And then he drove all the way back. Just think about that. He fucking ran off. He drove off. He's like, oh, it's gone? Okay, let me just... <laughs> you turn and came back and picked her up. I don't know. She's very important. She's a control tower. Misaka Network. Outside. Oh shit. We got an illegal immigrant. Okay. Going in and out of Academy City. No one can just simply come in and out. It's very rare. What about the church members? I'm sure they might have just snuck in, but okay. Well, it could be two people right now. I'm still thinking that it's him that drove all the way back and returned him, but maybe there's two separate people. Yo, fuck Julian's Cafe. This place sucks. Nah, dude, he's running out of money because of his fucking yellow sports car. He, he probably pays so much money on that shit. Hmm. Speaking from experience. Bye bye. Looks like we're gonna hunt them down. There's his car. Fancy ass car. He took Misaka. Yep. So that was him at the restaurant. Suspicious breathing. <laughs> she could literally die before the virus activates and his project's over. Huh, interesting. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Accelerator? No, just a crow. 
Kaka. That's a sign. That's a premonition. Someone's about to fucking show up. Maybe making even bird noises. I hope Accelerator starts beatboxing and goes like, <laughs> Where are you? <gasps> He's coming. The footsteps. Oh, Lord. <laughs> you ain't going nowhere. You ain't going nowhere. Do you not know who he is? I'm worried for Misaka, actually. He can clearly stomp this, but I'm worried for the impact in Misaka, bro. <laughs> Misaka didn't get damaged at all? Was she just locked into the seatbelt? The fuck? Well, Vector transform. He specifically made her forces to not, you know, go like that. Yeah, yeah, I think that's what she did, right? He definitely did that, right? Suspicious breathing. Pressure him. <laughs> Middle laser. Yeah. What's this doing? Brain cell operating ratio. Brain cell ratio. She might die before the virus even activates. Yoshikawa? Okay, she coming. Yo, Yoshikawa Loki goaded. She just showed up last episode, but I like everything about her so far. She's always like willing to help out Accelerator. She's so useful. <laughs> He's also speaking the language of the gods. She's glitching, bro. She fucking glitching, bro. She going crazy. She turned to rap god. What's she saying? What? What are you listening to? Uh-oh. Dummy info? We got fed lies? What the fuck? Wait, wait. Can we just shut Misaka off? When a computer has a virus, it's executing. Just turn the computer off. Can we just do that? Just to kind of freeze it? Okay. 10 minute timeline. I have no clue. No! Don't kill Misaka, Misaka. Kill her and save the other sisters? Nah, there's gotta be a way. A true main character, if he is a main character, should be able to make his pie and eat it too. Save everybody. No. No. Intermission. That was a fast intermission. She's still going to rap god. Yeah, we can't just like alter the direction of a virus, right? It doesn't make sense. What the fuck are we gonna do? What would that do? Reverse the flow. Last time you did this shit, you killed somebody by reversing their blood flow, but is there a way to save? Brain synapses? This is some fucking Jimmy Neutron shit. Brain blast! Whoa, he figured it out! Reverse the bioelectricity and somehow save Misaka Misaka. Mm. Like, 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 we can use the bioelectricity. We have her data backup here before that shit. Now we can swap. With this power, we can swap with bioelectricity backup data, sure. Yeah. Maybe. You would take the place of the learning apparatus? Control. No more reflections. Control. Is Accelerator about to also just like unlock new powers right now? Get better mastery of his powers? Controlling. 
He's about to surpass his limits. No, I refuse. This is my lolly. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> he, he didn't even hang up. He just threw the fucking phone. Fuck you. I'm gonna do this. Who do you think I am? Uh, I'll. This is some like CSS bullshit, bro. Height with Bori. It's a bunch of gibberish. It's putting it on the market. Is there anything making sense here? No, it's just a bunch of jumble mumbo. It's basically Madoka's like in Beyblade Madoka's laptop looking at different stuff. Div again. It's CSS, bro. CSS HTML. This is literally CSS HTML to the H tag, bro. This is fucking hacking. This ain't even a real fucking programming language, bro. This is a fucking HTML fucking any fucking like a middle school like a girl could like, you know, fix her fucking uh, website using this sh I don't know what the fuck he did there. He did beep, 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 beep. I don't know. Now he's gotten it. He's going to now bioelectricity. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Bioelectricity. Reverse the flow. We got the old data before the virus infection. Now somehow swap it. Oh, sound like a hero. Here we go. Yo, he's doing it. Erase the virus. Is it working? Is it working? Delete! Delete! Imagine someone just showed up here and just saw this scene. This wouldn't look very good, huh? They'd be like, what the fuck are you doing, Accelerator? What is that girl? What's happening right now? I promise we're saving her right now. 173,000 code left. Lines of code? What is it? Maybe you're erasing the memories that we shared together with, you know, little Misaka last episode. I'd be sad. He's doing it. Oh no! Can we reflect and control at the same time? I'm not sure. Do we have reflect on? I don't think so. No reflection. Maybe Yoshika will show up in clutch for us right now? Dodge it, bro. Just dodge it. I might be able to get a second chance. No, oh, these are his true thoughts. Huh? He wants some sort of redemption for himself. He knows he's a sinner. This is like atonement by saving someone else. Interesting characterization. Just dodge it, bro. Just dodge it. Easy. Oh! He really took the fucking hit. He really took a fucking hit. Damn, he tanked that shit. That speaks volumes, though. He, like, hard committed to save Misaka Misaka no matter what. There's no way he's dead, though. There's gotta be a different way. I mean, it's looking pretty bad, though. I don't know. <laughs> what about Misaka Misaka, though? I don't know. Uh oh. That's what's happening now. The legal process. We did it. Accelerator did it. I think that's good news. Accelerator did it. How did he do it? How did he? Save Misaka and save himself at the same time. I thought you could do one or the other. Oh! What? What did you do, bro? Oh, you. So, like, the speed at which we were, like, resetting Misaka, it completed just in time 
while the bullet is entering our skull into brain, but before it could do any damage, he reversed it. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> He sees himself as human scum. <laughs> yeah, we did do that. That's right, he saved the remaining, you know? We might have killed 10,000, but we saved the other 10,000. I think that uh, uh, redemption has been met. And on top of that, right? There was a whole like mental gymnastics last episode about how the decisions to make contact and talk to the Misaka clones that implies that you had a different desire than the hostility that you were showing. He's even yapping. He's even yapping like Toma, bro. One second, one second. Technical difficulty. There we go. There we go. Main character energy. Main character speech. Oh no, he's running out of juice. I mean, he did get still shot in the head. He ran out of juice. And the Yoshikawa will show up. Yoshikawa will show up now. Oh, you piece of shit. It's off. <laughs> Yoshikawa. Self-justifying piece of shit. No. Yoshikawa. Damn. Damn, bro. Is she cold? Gigakawa. Yoshi Goat. Got him. Fuck you. Got an incubator in the trunk, okay. Wait, he's still alive. Finish him. Double tap him. Therefore, you can kill her? Yeah, she was hearing the entire thing. Frog doctor. Lacking in presence? Yo, why the frog doctor right now getting shit on? He has no aura, according to Yoshikawa? A guy with no aura has the title Heaven Canceller. What? What is the implication there? That, like, if you die, you should go to heaven. But because he keeps saving motherfuckers before they die, He's canceling the heaven? <laughs> what is the logic, bro? I, I, I don't know, but it sounds like he's like defying the odds. The frog doctor will like defy the heavens. I, I don't know what the interpretation of that is, but... <coughs> These titles are fucking crazy, man. <coughs> These titles are fucking crazy. Like, Toma is like... Kamijo Toma, like literally the one who like, you know, stands above God or something. I don't know, like this shit is crazy. Yeah, I'll figure it out. What did you want to be before? <laughs> yeah. Okay. What a kind person. She has written a fan fiction about this. Yeah, she got Were you going with this? That you're just being nice? I'm not so nice? Dude, the gun gun! Yoshikawa is fucking crazy. Holy shit. Also, it's kind of... I can't believe she's, she, she allowed it to happen. I think this is intentional. Like, she's showing us what kind of person she really is. I'm not so soft. I was just being nice. I don't usually follow through because I'm soft, but maybe I was just being nice. The t-shirt stuff as well now. Now, you want to die together? You crazy? 
Maybe she also wants atonement? <laughs> both dead? Hello? I heard two shots there. I'm sure Heaven Cancellor can say both of them. There it is. Easy. So like, why did she allow that to happen? Was she actually seeking atonement? Did she feel guilty about the whole radio sister project? It, it, to me, it kind of like seemed that way based on her talking about how treating each student as, as if they're like unique and important and you know, she wanted to be nice and stuff like that. She went on like a quote unquote wrong path with the research. That looked like guilt from me. The heaven canceling frog did. Bro, you got shot through the coronary artery, artery and he still saved you? What the fuck kind of magic you got, bro? What kind of science you using? Yeah, dead on the spot. Accelerator stopped it. This guy. Dude, Accelerator basically did like neuro brain surgery with the bioelectricity flow, remembering the code and shit like that. Now he's basically doing like open heart surgery, transfer blood flow. Like, what the fuck? He, he's so fucking good. He's a professional. What? It's insane. He did a fucking open heart and a brain surgery basically at the same time. Unconscious. He did an unconscious. He did an unconscious open heart surgery, bro. What the fuck? It'll be fine. Frontal cortex, the brain. I wonder if this is why he now walks with like, you know, the crutch. I thought that it had to do with like the muscle dystrophy. I was not cooking at all when they were kind of talking about the tree diagram shit, looking at the, you know, the blimp shit. I, I really thought, you know, they were cooking with the uh, muscle dystrophy stuff, with, you know, accelerating the pharmacy, you know, stop making those products. But I guess this is what's going to happen with it. Can he do math anymore? When it's not possible, I'll make it possible. That's me. <laughs> you bullshit! Doctor! Bring Thomas' memories back, you fraud! Mm, the Misaka network. All of that shit will now actually save Accelerator. Huh. He killed 10,000. But he saved the 10,000 afterwards. And now they're saving him. In the trunk? In the incubator in your car? We have a girl like that in our charts? Uh oh. Is she a outlaw now? That's better than, you know, being charged as a criminal, I guess. Alright. Or jobless. Maybe she can apply. She can go talk to Sensei. Our Sensei, bro. And, uh, maybe she can get a teaching job. Be a teacher now. He'll do it. Damn! Ooh, heaven Cancellor! Alone all this time. He even knows what Accelerator might have been going through the entire time. Yo, Frog Doctor? He, this is so much aura. You see that this guy has no, like, you know, aura? Charisma? I mean, he does kind of look like a frog, and he does sexually harass his nurses, and that's the only reason that he became a doctor, apparently. Like, like, what? So you're telling me the best doctor in the world that defies the heavens was created simply because of his obsession with groping nurses' asses? Isn't that insane? <laughs> like, the, I don't know if that's, like, a joke. Maybe he was always joking about, you know, touching nurse bums and stuff like that. He's he just casually saying that shit. He's just smurfing. He's smurfing his lore. We don't know the truth yet. And then they saved you next. But here's the thing. Are you really a fiend? You may have killed 10,000, but you 
did save 10,000 by saving, you know, Misaka Misaka right now, the control tower. And now the 10,000 is, you know, basically repaying the favor. And that's another episode of Toaru no Accelerator. God damn, bro. His computational thinking, his calculations, like, what the fuck? I know it's not the exact same example, but he pretty much did a fucking brain surgery and then an open heart surgery while being unconscious. That is just mind blowing, bro. Just and again, and then the thing is, like, he finished the brain surgery, the code shit. As he was getting shot in the head, he committed, saved Misaka Misaka, and then changed the direction of the bullet before it landed, like, his brain damage. It's the, the, the amount of, like, precision, like, the frame-by-frame frame shit happening is beyond crazy. Like, the feats in this episode is fucking stupid OP. Yoshikawa seems to have this death wish... Maybe some gills, some atonements. I think that she could have ended out if she wanted to, but based on our way of talking, she feels guilty. She's always wanted to be a teacher. It's not that she's always been soft. It's just that she's been acting nice or something. And now she got laid off and maybe she can just be a teacher with our sensei now. Frog doctor, bro. Heaven counselor is crazy, man. This dude is so much aura. This is my battlefield. I make the impossible possible. Fuck you think who you're talking to. Pretty amazing. This arc was fantastic. I really, really enjoyed this. Now, the question is, did Misaka Misaka lose her memories with Accelerator? It's funny. More parallels of, you know, if this is supposed to be Accelerator's index. And now, you know, the midnight timing, the memory loss shit happening. Ironically, Index is the one that didn't lose the memories, but Toma did. But in this example, maybe Misaka Misaka will lose the memories. Who knows? But we only did hang her out, hang out with her like literally like less than a day. Straight up. Like, what do we know about her? Fucking nothing. We we literally spent like a couple hours at max. But it's not that it's not the time spent, it's more of the fact that, you know, we've been involved with the Radio Sister project, you know, the weight of the ten thousand killing, the burden, how he never actually he wanted like a different outcome by approaching them and making contact stuff like that. I, I think that for sure this arc has shown us a completely different side of Accelerator. He is truly a kind person deep inside. He views himself as this irredeemable scumbag. He thought that by saving her maybe you know there's like a second chance for someone even like him. So very deep and complex character and someone whose past that I would I would love to know but I'm sure that's gonna be like Spoiler territory, maybe some cut content, you know, talked about his first name, his given name, his last name, two or three characters each. Don't know what's going on with the military pursuing him. Is this even Academy City? Probably not. Who knows, but crazy. That's it for me. If you're still here, though, if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for even more content. And until next time, take care.